Wrecker is by far the strongest clone of all time, but just how strong is he? In this video, we're going to try to estimate Wrecker's one rep max for the bench press. The best view we have of Wrecker's physique is in season one, episode one. The dude is massive, but there are people who are bigger that exist in today's world. Shaquille O'Neal, for example, stands at seven foot one and weighs 305 pounds, but he benched 450 pounds. Wrecker is about 5 inches shorter than the NBA star, but he seems to be only a little bit lighter. Wrecker is definitely more dense and muscular than Shaq. I would estimate that Wrecker weighs about 300 or 310 pounds. And by using strengthlevels.com, we can see that a 310 pound lifter at the elite level can bench approximately 523 pounds. But Wrecker is not just your average elite lifter. He's genetically enhanced. Let's consider one of his lifting feats. In Season 7 of The Clone Wars, Wrecker lifts a gunship off of Cody. Using the weight of a small aircraft, we can estimate that a gunship weighs about 37,000 pounds. Now considering the gunship was heavily damaged during the accident and Wrecker didn't carry the entire thing, we can estimate that the mass of the object that Wrecker moved was about 25,000 pounds. However, this lift was done by rotating the ship along a certain point. That's completely different than lifting an object straight up. Regardless, it proves that Wrecker is able to move a very large amount of weight. Another testament to his strength is when Wrecker fought an adolescent Rancor and kept up with the physical aggression the Rancor was using. My estimate is that Wrecker could bench a thousand pounds and that breaks the world record of 782 pounds set by Julius Maddox. Even though 1,000 pounds is incredibly impressive, it's important to note that Wrecker is primarily a fighter and a soldier. He's not a power lifter. With his genetics, he has the ability and the potential to bench much more than he does right now. But that would come at the cost of his athletic ability, and it would reduce his speed and agility, making him much less efficient on the battlefield. But what do you think? How strong is Wrecker? How much do you think he can bench? Let me know in the comments below, and make sure you check out the video on the screen now.